the cost of doing something fun with the family, prices are going up and up and up. But we've been working to find you options across the tri-state to help you bring those prices back down. I want to go on the spending swing. Post-pandemic, many families like the Fergusons are opting to spend more money on experiences. I think it's just I enjoy doing those things with them and they're as, as a family as opposed to just buying them more stuff. But the problem. I want to go fast. Funflation. The prices of those activities they love to do together. Um, outrageous. <laughs> here in Cincinnati, I compared pre-COVID ticket prices to now. The numbers may shock you. The Newport Aquarium in 2019, a child ticket cost $17.99. Today, it's $26.99, a 50% increase. A Kings Island single day pass up 43% now compared to pre-COVID pricing. I can't believe how expensive going to a Reds game is. From 2019 to now, the average Reds ticket has gone up 17%. If you're taking your kids, they want ice cream, they want pizza. Um, all those things. The same goes for travel. Opted out on a vacation this year and just did something small. The price is forcing many families to look for alternatives. It's good to find things that are more affordable, um, but you still get a great experience. Um, this place is excellent. Recreations outlet in Milford has playground equipment, trampolines, basketball hoops, and more for kids to run around and blow off some steam. And during charitable play. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, it's $4 per child. Uh, and it runs from 9 a.m. to 11. And 50% of profits go to Big Brothers Big Sisters of Greater Cincinnati. In Hamilton County, a library card will get you into places like the Cincinnati Museum Center, Cincinnati Observatory, or the Art Museum completely free. And for the movie lovers, Cinemark offers discounted movies on Tuesdays. Many are trying new things this summer. Maybe we're going to things like there's the paint playground um, just outside of Old Milford, and it's just something different. Families across the area are weighing in. We'll have a list of some of the other budget-friendly suggestions on our website, WCPO.com. Reporting from Milford, Taylor Nimmo, WCPO 9 News.